Right. Amen. Beans, like string beans, tip, you know, uh, sweet peas. England, we call them English peas in the South, but sweet peas, green peas, they don't naturally grow. If you're going to get a harvest of sweet peas, amen, sugar snap peas, you must put them on a trellis so that they will be trained to grow up. If you just leave them by themselves, they will never grow up to produce because the little peas will fall, will hit the ground, and the ground have microbes that begin to make them rot and return back to the earth. The same with tomatoes. Let a tomato plant grow, lay on the ground. And that, to, girl, bless your heart. You know. <laughs> you know what wings we do in here. She got a piece of chicken. <laughs> All right. Amen. <laughs> Leo, you are you cool with me? <laughs> oh, Leo. Hey, she changed the whole tenor of my thing. <laughs> my heart just went a whole different way. Green peas. Green peas in a trellis. But anyway, let me get When we, you know, our heart is, and I just want to talk to us about the capability. Our heart is capable of doing what Adam did, but our heart is prone to doing what sin has called it to do. And one of the areas where we have a problem is really we've been to this, if I can just deal with us in a real honest way today, is that we don't know how to be honest. It's hard for us to be honest all the time in our hearts. And when we can't be honest in our hearts, we put on facades, we put on shows, we, you know, we don't live a transparent life. One that, you know, where I don't have to be afraid I have to, one where I don't have to look over my shoulders and wonder what did I say yesterday. One that where I don't have to be afraid of somebody coming in and examining my closet, the closet, you know, because if you want to see something, just come on in and check it out. You got nothing to hide. It's hard for us to live like that because the heart is our heart that is got these got this blinding effect, that thing going on. I don't want people to know how weak I am on the inside. I don't want people to know, amen, about my shortcomings. I don't want anyone to know about, you know, my fears, my concerns. I don't want anybody to know my dreads. This is why the Lord tells us this, that it's time to break up that fallow ground now. It's time for us to speak the truth in our hearts, to really, to walk upright, amen, and speak the truth in the heart. Now, please note, church, he didn't say speak the truth outside to everybody. He said speak the truth in your heart. Because let me tell you, you know, you can't really be truthful to anyone until you're true to yourself. Mm -hmm. To that end, Shakespeare said, to thine own self, be true. If you can't be true to yourself, it's going to be hard for you to be true to anybody else. If you can't be true to yourself, if you can't be true to yourself, it's going to be hard for you to be true in, in anything else. Mm -hmm. Truth in the inward part will bring truth in the outward part. Amen. 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 You know, and, and, and there are a lot of uh, kids, because they would not speak the truth in their heart, because a lot of times parents beat them down so, you know, you are going to be, you are going to be, you are going to be. That the children, amen, you got uh, uh, children who should be uh, in, in the field of agriculture. They could be, I'm talking about, you got, you got let's say like this, this guy who says that he had come up with this brand new thing of, to produce diesel. Can you imagine a parent who beat that child, you're going to be, you're going to be, but that child, and, and they go on to be that scientist, they go on to be, amen, that lawyer, they go on to be that doctor, but they hate every moment of it. 
Because that's really, they're not being really true to their inner man. Their inner man want to be a person who grows plants. They want to explore plants. They want to explore. And here it is because they're not true to the inner man. They are in a field where they hate, but they're going to stay there because that's what they done got to, accustomed to providing a living for them. Church, it's time for us to get true, be really true to our, in our hearts. Amen. Yes, ma'am. Sister. I think what you're saying is a lot of people just settle. Settle. We settle for, we settle for, we settle for what somebody else has chosen for us. We settle for a lifestyle that has been chosen for us, not a lifestyle that we have chosen. My God. We, and, and this is time to us, church, God said, be true, be honest, be true to yourself, be true in your heart. Speak the truth in your heart. Amen. Now, I don't want to get too much into the social aspect of it. Amen. But it is important for us to socially let people be free. Because a lot of times we demand people to be something when really they don't want to be. Amen. You see, I could easily say based upon the way that you sing, you sing, you sing, that you all got to be the choir. But if that's not what God has called you to, then don't you do that. Amen. If that's not speak the truth, but if that is what is true in your spirit, my God, can't nobody be able, and won't nobody be able to hold you back. Because it's in you to explore and to expand that area that God has put in you. Speak the truth in your heart. Amen. Amen. And church is very important. Amen. Jeremiah who said, break up the fellow ground. Amen. There are some things that God has put in you, you just can't be quiet. You just, I'm talking about they burn in you. There, there is a yearning. There is a, I'm talking about I, it, some, see, some of you all got to lift your hands up and praise the Lord because God has just put it in you to lift up those hands. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. And just Amen. tell the Lord, thank you. Amen. It's not a hard thing for you to do. You just, man, just, 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 you just, just give me the turn on one moment. Amen. And I'm, yeah, I'm going to go on and praise him. Amen. Because it's in you to magnify the Lord. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. It's in you to worship him. Amen. And church, this is why, you know, uh, it, 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 uh, the, the, social, the social aspect, the communal aspect is important. That sometimes we, wanna, we want to put people in, in holes and put them in positions and put them in here. But unless the Lord give you the leading, the unction to go that way, church, follow the leading of Amen. the Lord. Amen. Amen. Right. Amen. Speak the truth in your heart. Amen. God has called you to be a teacher. Amen. Don't you sing in the choir. God has called you, amen, to cook chicken. Come on, somebody. <laughs> amen. Don't, don't, don't try to, amen. Do, walk in the, be, speak the truth in your heart. Now, that's the social aspect of it. Let's get to the spiritual aspect of it. Amen. Church, and I'm just going to read some of the things that, 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 that we wrote. The present generation, like many others, is a generation of outlookers. Amen. We look outside. We, you know, instead of us looking inside, we look outside. Instead, mm -hmm. we, we care about, amen, the way, come on now, if I don't want my beer overalls in here today, you see, why did I wear my beer overalls in here today? Amen. Is it because I care about what you all think? No, because I didn't have no beer overalls. <laughs> <laughs> but we are not who we are outside. We're yeah. really, we, Sister Melody, we are who, who we are who we are inside. inside and if you outside. are a liar inside, inside you inside. come on outside. somebody. You are a liar. God amen, is not looking at the outward appearance, but the Lord is looking at the heart. Amen. So church is imperative for us. Amen. And, I, and, and, and this is not an indictment. This is just a reality. Mm -hmm. We become outward lookers. We are outward seekers. Mm -hmm. Amen. We are seeking for approval from people from the outside. Well, we seek. The Amen. It, you see, there it goes. All of this stuff from the outside. Amen. We are, we are outward impressors. We seek to impress. Amen. From the outside. Everything is outside. 